Hello and welcome to some more new Super Mario Bros. U. So, between the last video and this one, I did a bit of exploring. I actually totally forgot that about the ice world that we skipped and decided to do the water world instead. That being said, we already got a start on the soda jungle. So, we're going to start with that in this one. And then I think once we finish soda jungle, we are going to just backtrack and head back and do the ice world. So if you've never been to my channel before, please consider subscribing. Also, if you enjoy the video, please leave a like, please leave a comment, and... Okay, there's nothing there. Good. Um, leave a like, leave a comment, consider subscribing, you know, all that same stuff that we talk about all the time as people on YouTube. Dang, couldn't get an extra life. And yeah, hopefully you enjoy the video. So what I'm doing here, if you haven't seen any of the previous videos, is I'm basically going for... for a casual 100% playthrough of New Super Mario Bros. U in honor of the 10th anniversary of the Wii U and of this game in general. Alright, this has to lead somewhere, right? <laughs> I I had a sneaking suspicion that that's what was going to happen. Come back here, Koopa. Give me those coins. Perfect. Alright, so yeah. If you haven't seen any of the worlds so far, we've played through three of the worlds. we found everything. Ow. <laughs> including, um, like all the secret stuff that's involved. Found the secret levels, found all the star coins. Oops. There we go. Sweet! I was kind of thinking that, um, oh, I forgot I don't have firepower. Um, I was thinking that there was going to be the second big coin there. Alas, it was not there, but that's okay. Nothing down there. There we go. Aha. No! There we go. Oh man. I did not think I was gonna get that. Oh, I just missed that last one. Man, I was farming extra lives really good there. So this has to go this way. Let's see what kind of goodies we get here. Ooh, a star. There it is. <laughs> the last star coin. Boy, I'm in a bit of a pickle here now. I mean, I can't get it, so... We're just gonna have to come back for it. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna cut away, come back to this part, and then we'll grab that uh, third star coin. Oh, there we go. Just had to believe in that star power, but we made it. 
Okay, well, we ended up getting a branching path that came out of this. So let's do Soda Jungle 2 first. Bridge over poison waters. Simon and Garfunkel would not approve of that, I don't think. Come on, get up there. There we go. Oh my god. How are you supposed to get up there? I'm so confused. Well, this works. <laughs> and all I got was an acorn for that. Well, fair enough. There's the first star coin there. I mean, that was easy enough to get. Here we go, number two, hopefully. Yes. So if I make all of these appear, and then I activate that POW, that should get me the rest of the coins, right? Just wait patiently, wait for the peak to run out. There we go. Give me all the coins. So I'm guessing the challenge here is just that if you let it spin too far, you fall into the poison? It's not really a big challenge, so... We should be able to make it through this, no problem. Oh crap. I spoke too soon. me that. Thank you! <laughs> that was kind of lucky. Oh god. I missed the last one. Gosh darn it. Oh well. Ooh, is this a pipe for me to go up? Or is it just a... a secret of some kind? Hmm, I don't know. But, we got all the three star coins. Another pretty easy level. So I guess we'll go to the other side. We'll check out... what I assume will be Soda Jungle number three. Bramble Woods. Oh, not these guys. Don't you have to, like, bonk them or something to kill them? I can't remember exactly, but I think that's what you have to do. You hit them from, like, underneath or something. I don't know. Hopefully I didn't need that acorn. Oh. Oops. Oh, you can just freeze.
And then can I ground pound through them? Nice. Do I want to ground pound this guy? <laughs> There's got to be something hidden here, right? Oh, why else would these platforms be here? Oh, maybe on the right here? You can't fool me, Mario. I wasn't born yesterday. Ow. Must. Murder. Yes! Firepower. Give me firepower. The audio keeps... It keeps messing up in my earphone, so I'm really scared that it's messing up. During the recording, too. I didn't look into that in the last video, so... I don't know, but I hope not. Oh, I see that last star coin. I mean, that was easy enough to get. Wait, there's a mini mushroom exit? Okay, where's the mini mushroom? Ow. Where's the mini mushroom? I know you're hiding it here somewhere. I wonder if that's like a secret... Exit to a secret level. But I don't remember coming across anything. Nothing there. This, like, brick here. No? So what's with the, the mini mushroom pipe? Well, let's just go to the end here. We can investigate later on. At least we got all three of the star coins. Mini mushroom, where could you be? Like, I didn't even see any pipes to go down to really collect anything. I don't know. Anyways, let's keep going. We're gonna check out the tower, which I, th I think was where the last one led. And then we'll see time-wise if we're gonna check out any other ones. I know this world is a lot bigger than the previous three worlds, just in terms of how many levels there are. So we might get through five levels. Maybe six? Who knows? I'm just curious, for people that watch these videos, I was watching, um, I think it was a Game Grumps video a couple of weeks ago, and basically they were just talking about how people have commented that, um, people have said that they don't necessarily watch the videos but it's almost more like an ASMR experience where they put it on when they're like working on something or you know like just as background noise that sort of thing so I'm just curious for people that are out there that might watch these videos like what makes you watch these videos 
Is it for the gameplay? Is it just background noise? Is it... A number of different things? Who knows? Oh, checkpoint. That's convenient. Um, but yeah, because then I was sort of thinking about it too, and it's like, well, actually, I tend to just listen to Game Brum Game 2 as more background noise than anything. Like, I don't necessarily watch it for the games that they play. I watch it as just something to have on, like, in the background. Ow. Especially if it's a game that I'm not necessarily interested in watching them play. And I don't mean that in a bad way at all. Oh god. Oh god. Oh. Ow. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm just curious again for people that are out there. Do you watch these videos to learn some new stuff about like Mario Maker? To watch me play Mario games? You know, what's your, what's your reason for watching? Somehow we survived that. I did not think we would. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Alright, let's do this. I just noticed too that my gamepad is about to die. So this is probably gonna be the last video that I make today. I really wish I could find my charger for my Pro Controller. I, I love that controller. But on the other hand, playing this ow on the gamepad means that I can also watch basketball, which is on right now on my main screen, or watch the World Cup when that starts. Well, when this video comes out, the World Cup has already started, but for me it hasn't started yet, so... Alright, well, we have time for at least one more level in this video, so... I think we're gonna head down, see what we have waiting for us next. Oh god, yes, save please, before I forget. Oh, of course it's a ghost house. Though I gotta say, I love the Starry Night Vincent Van Gogh style of this overworld map. It's really cool. It looks really nice. Oh, well. Boo, can you stay over there, please? Where do we go first? Guess we'll go in here? I don't know, we'll just pick one. What in the hell? Okay, so that sinks down. I see a door in the bottom right. Oh, star coin. Oh, thank god I can get back up here. What are these, Mike Tyson ghosts? Okay. Guess we'll try this one? <laughs> I... I don't know if there's any rhyme or reason to any of these, but... Okay, well this is a big help, for sure. So we got mice up there, we got mice down there. Wait, 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 have I told the story about how I have mice in my classroom at school? They ended up... So... There was a mouse sighting like maybe a month ago or so. And then like a couple weeks later, all of a sudden I could hear the scurrying in my class and it was ugh, it was gross. I I couldn't stand the sound. I couldn't concentrate. So they ended up catching one of the mice in the classroom across from mine. Ooh, which door do I pick? Upper or lower? Um, but then literally that same day, there were mice, uh, more mice that were scurrying in another classroom. 
It's so gross. Oh, I can take you with me? I assume we should go through this door. It looks more secrety. I don't know where to go. There are just so many doors. Oh? <laughs> well, and apparently there was an, a secret one as well. Ooh, star coin. Um, but anyways, yeah, so there's a nice big mouse infestation in my classroom. It's wonderful. And by wonderful, obviously I'm being very sarcastic. Well, now where do I go? Which, which door do I choose? Let's go with this one. Okay, we cannot. Then let's go for this one. Oh god, it's Big Boo. Let me just keep spinning here. Just keep spinning, just keep spinning, just keep spinning, spinning, spinning. Oh god. Yes, please. I guess we just go through the door. Hmm. We missed the third star coin somewhere. Well, I think we need to go back. And we need to find that last star coin. So that's going to be my goal here. We're going to finish this off. We're going to find... So where where do these two lead? Because we never check the left doors. Oh, thank god there is a secret area there. Except I got squished. <laughs> okay, so, we kind of have an idea now. This is another area we never got to explore, so... Let me just grab that. Head back here. And let's do this. And then we just gotta hang out on the left. Stay away. Stay back. I have a Yoshi and I know how to use it. Back I say. Okay, let's see where this takes us. Hmm. 
Oh. Well, that's convenient. I... <laughs> I was not expecting that. And we found a secret exit. Is this going to take us to a secret level? I mean, I guess we'll find out. Alright, let's just see what happens here before we end the video. Take us. Up into the clouds. Cloud world? Is this the bonus level or is this a new world? This is Soda Jungle Parabeetle level. Well, I guess we're going to get started with that in the next video. But if you enjoyed this one, please leave a like, leave a comment, consider subscribing. Like I said, we're going to check out the rest of Soda Jungle next time. But until then, have a good one and I'll talk to you later. Thank you.